affected. Well, state transportation officials are blaming severe corrosion on what compromised the Leo Frigo Bridge in Green Bay. And meanwhile, they're preparing for extra traffic this weekend during the Packers game while the bridge remains closed. Wisconsin DOT held a news conference earlier today. Officials there reporting that there has been no further movement since one of the piers supporting the bridge dropped a couple of feet a week ago. DOT officials report heavy corrosion was discovered on that sinking pier. We found out why or what happened. We're trying to figure out why and what the puzzle we're putting together now is with all the soil samples and water samples, we have to get our arms around that data to find out how many piers does this actually affect. More than 31,000 vehicles normally use that bridge during a Packers game. DOT officials are recommending that fans leave early and use alternate routes. But as we said earlier, you have to use an alternate route because that's 